the first time ever an all-black team is heading to the National High School Championships in the sport of squash, and they're from Harlem. CBS 2's Jesse Mitchell introduces us to the Thurgood Marshall Academy boys who hope to make a big impression. One, two, three, four. United in black, the Thurgood Marshall Panthers proudly stepped to the national stage. I sat down with eight teammates at the Harlem nonprofit Street Squash, where they learned the game. It's a very humbling experience, just to be a part of like something bigger. Last semester, after playing for fun for years, they petitioned their school for squash as an official sport, allowing them to enter the national high school tournament. Their coach, Simba Mawati, grew up playing squash in Zimbabwe before coming to compete in college in the States, where the sport looked a lot different. It was super affluent here, and the rest of the world it's not. It's actually pretty middle class and below. These student athletes squash any notion the court sport is better suited for kids of privilege. Being the only all black team, we grow up with a lot of stereotypes. It's deeper than squash. Like squash has opened a lot of doors for me. During league play with street squash, team members traveled across the country and even to England to compete against players from all different backgrounds. My opponent was a 50 year old man. So I didn't think really nothing of it because. He was up there in age, and like, he showed me some new things. He was a really good opponent. Their eyes have been open to a lifelong hobby, and they're opening others' eyes to new opportunities. Getting a chance to be a public school in Harlem, it's like we already done did so much. Let's believe our name will be heard. Yep. History will be made. Win or lose, they're just learning to enjoy the ride. If I don't shed a tear, I'll be shocked. It'll be probably the most proud moment of my career in squash. To walk into that facility with these young men is going to be super special. In Harlem, Jesse Mitchell, CBS 2 News. And the TMA Boys Squash Team is raising money to support their trip to Philadelphia. If you'd like to donate, you can head to this story in the Community Journalism tab on our website, cbsnewyork.com. Go TMA. Yeah. Who knew? Looking good already. Absolutely.